Defending outright Western Athletic Conference men's basketball champion, New Mexico State Aggies will play their regular season game against Northern New Mexico at the Santa Ana Star Center in Rio Rancho. Tip-off is set for 7 p.m. tonight here in uh, in the Duke City area. I guess we could say Rio Rancho, not really Duke City. Joining us now is New Mexico State Deputy Athletic Director uh, Chet Savage. So, Chet, this is a pretty exciting thing. Uh, you guys bring in a home game for the Aggies up into into Lobo country, sort of, so sure. to speak. But this is really cool because there are a lot of Aggie fans out here and you guys are given the opportunity to represent tonight. Absolutely, this is really born out of something from our fans uh, and the feedback that we receive whenever we're up north here. Uh, hey, when are, when are the Aggies gonna play in Albuquerque? Right. Certainly we have the, uh, the annual game with the Lobos at the pit, mm -hmm. but those tickets can be difficult to get a hold of and if they are, maybe they're in the upper regions of the arena. Right. So we thought it was important to um, take a home game from Las Cruces, move it up here. We have over 10,000 alums in the greater Albuquerque area. Mm -hmm. And uh, so here we are. And uh, we certainly want all the Aggies and all the college basketball fans to come out to the Santa Ana Star Center and watch a great game. As you mentioned, it's the first time we've played a regular season game mm -hmm. um, in Albuquerque. Mm -hmm. And we're really excited to do so. And and being it considered the home game, because Chet, you, you hit on the, you know the thing saying that you know every year everyone looks forward to you know the Rio Grande rivalry, the Lobos and the Aggies going at it. But this is an opportunity for our Aggies to have home court advantage, so to speak. And the, I mean, you you know as well as I do, you go to see a basketball game, it's got a different vibe, it's got mm -hmm. a different feel to it, right? Uh, so uh, there are some reserve seats that we want to talk about. Is that right? Absolutely, reserve certainly. Um, you know, this is a this is a home game for so. As far as the Aggies are concerned, we certainly need to uh, to sell tickets mm -hmm. and uh, reserved. It's a it's a great venue. It's a very intimate venue. Mm -hmm. The the setup for basketball is less than six thousand. Mm -hmm. So we do have reserved seats. We have courtside seats uh, at fifty dollars. We also have reserved lower level seats as little as ten dollars. Oh great! So the three okay. price points: you have courtside seats for fifty. You have side Which court, mid-court. you can't mid find that in college basketball. No, $50 certainly not. $50 court side seats. Certainly not. That is very rare. So this is a great opportunity yeah, to see yeah, some great you, basketball Yeah, close. something to be said when you walk into an arena and you walk all the way down or you don't use any stairs at all depending on the configuration. Yeah. yeah so for $50, you can have your feet on the lumber. Yeah, exactly. Uh, right there. You got Here's the thing, though. One of you, though, I'm going to put it out there, Aggie fans. One of you has got to do a Jack Nicholson for us. You got to wear the glasses. You got to sit courtside like this watching the game the whole time. We welcome it. Right. I'll, 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 if they got an open seat next to them, I'll join them. <laughs> There you go, absolutely. All right, so uh, so this is the first time happening. Uh, obviously, depending on how it goes, we'll, we'll see. But is, is this something that we can expect to see in the future in New Mexico State, bring in more home games up to our Aggie, uh, our Aggie alum here in Albuquerque? Well, you know, I, I think certainly this is a good beta test. Right. It is our wish to, to have a presence annually, not just for basketball, but, you know, for, for the university and the athletic department have a presence here. Certainly, yeah. we have a great alumni base. We have a, a great population. You know, I know it's, again, Lobo country. Yeah. But certainly, we want individuals to have an affinity for the Aggies and, and send their kids. And we yeah. want kids to come down to Las Cruces and go to school, too. Yeah, absolutely. So this is an area that we have to uh, ha be involved with. Yeah. And so if there is certainly success with tonight's game, mm -hmm. I don't think it's out of the question that we would try to do this on an annual basis. Yeah. And uh, because this area is very important to us yeah. for many reasons as an institution. Absolutely. So Chip, very quickly, we want to get tickets to tonight's game. Where do we go? Uh, very simple. You can, go to the, you can go to the Santa Ana Star Center tonight, buy them at the window, mm -hmm. uh, or if uh, you're a little bit more tech savvy, the, most tickets are bought online these days, mm -hmm. go to SantaAnnaStarCenter.com, okay. purchase your tickets, they'll be at well call for you. Again, little as $10 for a lower level reserve seat, sit at mid-court, $20, or you can have your seat on, feet on the for lumber 50. for court side for 50 That's fantastic, Chet Savage. Thank hey, you so much. Appreciate you have having a, us. Have a great game tonight. Again, Thanks guys, so for more information on catching the Aggies on their home turf here in Albuquerque, how many times can we say that ever? Uh, let's make it a lot Once more. Once now, but Once you know, maybe, now. maybe twice next year. Exactly. More to come.